everybody, it's me, Mrs. Bench. I was shopping the other day and I found these fidget pets called Squirkies. So you know I had to buy them for you so I can unbox them and let you know what I think of them. I wanted to collect the entire set, but I didn't want any duplicates. So I got as many individual ones as I could. There's quite a bit of options here and they were kind of expensive. I actually ended up spending $266.21. So that is actually a lot of money, but I'm gonna let you know what I think and if they're worth it or not. The background says they're fidget pets full of fun from a world where all things click, twist, wobble, and pop. They're little pets full of fun fidgets. Once you pick them up, you just can't put them down. Well, let's see if that's really true. I'm gonna open them all first. So just give me a second. I think I'm just gonna open every single box all at once and then kind of review them one by one. First up, we have the Clickety Cat. So she is purple, her ears go back and forth, and the eyes move at the same time. Okay, that's pretty cute, right? The nose pushes in. There's not a sound though. That's I mean, like a very slight sound, but it's not like a clicker. It's not like a big sound. And then the tail, that is so cute. Oh my gosh, this is good. So this was the clickety cat. Super cute. Next we have the pop tube puppy. I'm so excited to pull her apart. Mm. Okay, it wasn't as satisfying as I was hoping for. I actually love pop tubes. I love the pop tube sound and the pop tube feeling. This is okay. It's not as exciting as I thought it would be, but it's not bad. Let's try the tail. Tail doesn't do anything. Okay, the tongue. Oh, the tongue pushes up and then back and it makes a little clicking sound and also moves the eyes. It's like it's rolling its eyes. Oh my goodness, that's so funny. Its eyes go up and down. So let's see about its ears. Oh, its ears go up and down too. Oh my goodness, this is so good. It's not as good as the cat, actually. I feel like the cat was a little more satisfying, but this is also super cute, and I just love the idea of it. The third one that came in that pack of three is the Toggle Turtle. So right away, I'm squeezing the side of it. Super satisfying, I love it. Let me kind of explore and see what else it can do. The top also clicks and it makes a really good click. I love that sound. The tail up and down and it makes a nice loud sound. Let's see. Okay, so the head like moves, but I feel bad because I feel like I'm smushing its face. What am I missing? I feel like it should move when I do, okay. So this one, the eyes don't seem to move. The eyes don't seem to move, like they seem stationary. Cause remember on here, the eyes moved side to side. Boing, 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 boing. Like you shifty eyed. And then this one, when you did the tail, up and down, up and down. This one, I don't think the eyes move. They seem stationary. And the only way to get the head to move is to like literally smush his face in. I don't like that. I don't like that. But the side clicks are good. The side clicks are probably the only thing I would use on this little turtle. Okay, not as good, but that was still really fun. So first three pack, that's good. I'm gonna give it like an eight out of 10. And then I think we're gonna do the other three pack. Might as well get the big ones out of the way right at the beginning. As I'm opening this, I just realized a few things. I have a clickety cat in here too, but at least it's a different color. So this one was purple. This one is going to be a metallic, metallic one, which is a little more rare, I believe, because on the back they tell you there are metallic finishes and then there are classics and there are glow in the dark. So I already got this clickety cat, the purple one in classic, and now I'm about to get the metallic clickety cat. But 
when I realized I was getting a metallic clicky cat, it made me look over here and I realized I was like, I don't want to get duplicates, but I have a purple clickety cat. I don't want two purple clickety cats. So I'm actually going to return this one. And then I have another clickety cat, but this one is in yellow. So I'll keep them because it's a different color. And then these ones, I have two pop tube dogs, but they're in different co colors because this one's metallic, which is a little more rare. This one is classic. This one is blue and white. I think I'm actually gonna return this classic one because it's pretty much the same as this one, except this one's metallic. So I think I'll return the classic and keep the rare. So it actually turns out that I have a lot less, well, two less to unbox than I thought, because I'm gonna return these two because I already have them in the three packs. I guess I didn't realize I wasn't looking as closely as I thought I was. Oh no. No! Another turtle. It's a different color scheme, but again, I don't think, I wonder if this is a glow in the dark one. Let me see. No, the toggle turtle isn't even in one of the glow in the dark options. This is a different color scheme, but honestly, I'm gonna return this one too, because they're kind of expensive. So I don't wanna spend a lot of money and have duplicates. I'd rather have like one of each type. Metallic, that's okay, because it's extra special, but not like different color schemes of the same. Let me know what you would do in this situation. Would you keep the different colorways of the same item, or would you just want one colorway? Let me know. I am super excited to try this squiggly snake. So I'm really, really excited. This is my, I like, obviously it's the first time I opened it, it reminds me a lot of a tangle from the look of it. Oh, hang on. Okay, so comes apart. So it's like a tangle where they like snap in. Does not move as smoothly. It's not move. It's more like a snake. Like, you know, the snakes, how you have to like click them. Mm, okay. It doesn't move freely. I was kind of hoping it would move more freely. Well, it's fine. It's, this is fine. I have to like figure out how I can fidget with it, if that makes sense. Okay. Tongue. Tongue is stretchy and silicone. I can like pull it out and snap it in. And then it looks like the eyes do move, but I have to move them. Nope. Here we go. Okay. The head clicks. I like that. That's the first thing on this that I've liked. I didn't like anything else yet, but that is good. I like that. I like that loud sound. Okay, that's good. Now let's figure out these eyes. So they move like this. It's like not satisfying now, it's like hard to do. I'm trying to figure out if I just need to get like in the groove. Don't like it. Let's try the other side. Same thing. Mm, no. Okay, so so far the only fidget feature that I really like on this one is twisting the head. Um, it's really, they come apart too easily. So this just keeps unclicking without me wanting it to. Like I want it to stay clicked. And it keeps, un they, they come apart too easy. Like they're not, that side, that joint's good. So it sounds like some of the joints can be good. Like this one was hard to pull apart. That's what I want. Like I wanna only pull it apart when I want to, but this one just keeps popping open and I don't even want it to, so. Okay, mm, I don't really like this one. I had really high hopes for it, so maybe that's why I was a little more disappointed, but I'm gonna give it a five out of 10. Let's see what else we got. This is a cheeky pop monkey. So, let, oh, I know why it says it's cheeky. I just looked down. It's little bum cheeks are poppets. Okay, I feel a little bit weird doing this. Let's try it. Well, how do you get them back? Wait, hang on. Okay, so I popped his butt cheeks, but there's gotta be a way to pop them back. 
how do they pop back? I had to take a quick intermission to figure it out because I could like literally I was like, I don't understand. So I pop in his little bum cheeks and then I had to figure out how to get them open or pop back out and you just do it with his ears. Ready? Pop. I like it. I like it. It's good. So pop them, pop them. 10 out of 10. This is funny. I think it's funny. I think it works perfectly. The pops are good. Listen, oh, that was kind of a sad pop, but listen. Okay, let me try again. It's like a little, it's not like super loud, but then it's good enough, you know? I like it, I like it. So that's super funny, super unique. Like, I think that's good. Then the tail, loud, I like it. Ooh, even louder the other way. So if you go clockwise, it's good sound. Counterclockwise, even better. Mwah, chef's kiss, love it. Okay, it looks like the, the eyes should move on this one, but I'm not, like, the eyes kind of look like they should move, but I'm not sure how to get them to move. I only see the little bum cheeks, ears, but it doesn't move when the ear, ears move. That's kind of what I was thinking. Let's try the tail. Oh, they move with the tail and I was so focused on the sound that I didn't notice it. Okay, they move with the tail very minimally. There's not too much movement, but do you see it a little bit? I love it. I think the monkey is my favorite. 10 out of 10 for the monkey. Next, I have another clickety cat, but this time it's metallic, which I think it doesn't say like rare. It just says metallic finish. So they don't have like tiers, like rare, ultra rare, anything like that. It just says metallic, classic, glow in the dark. I really, really, really wanted the pop butterfly. If you can see right here, there's a butterfly, but they didn't have it available at the store when I was there. So I'll go back and check for it later because I love butterflies. And that was one I really wanted. So there's actually a lot that I still want. Let's see. I have a chameleon here, and another dog, and another cat, but I don't know if I want this cat. I already have two clickety cats. Okay, I'm gonna return four altogether because these are two more clickety cats. This is a pop tube dog, and this is the turtle, just in different colorways. So I'm gonna return four of them. And when I return those, I'm hoping that they'll have a pop bop butterfly, that's adorable, a jiggle jellyfish, uh, I want a swirly whirly hedgehog, I want a squishing fish, let's see what else, a spin fin axolotl, and a switchy scorpion. Those are the ones I still need. So I'm gonna return these four different colorways, and then when I return them, I will go back I will look for those other items and let me know if you want me to unbox those as well. So right now I'm back at the clickety cat, but this is the metallic version. So the ears were cute. Remember they go and they move the eyes. This is the best eye movement out of any of them. It's like that like shifty eh, 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 eyes. I love it. And then the tail, good sound, nice and clicky and loud and satisfying. The nose, boop, 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 love it. And then the feet, twist. So, cat's good. I like the cat. So now I have it in two colorways. I have metallic and purple, which purple and teal are some of my favorite colors anyways. Purple is my favorite color, so. Sorry, little guy, I didn't mean to throw you after telling you you were my favorite color. But yeah, look what I just noticed when I was doing that. Okay, look at the nose, see how far out it is? Let me see if I can get even closer. Push it in, it's It's like squished up in there. Push it, it comes out. Do you see how it like grows? Reminds me of like Pinocchio. So these are really cool. Like there's so many different fidget features on these toys. I highly recommend. This one, doesn't make that sound. It's really easy to twist the feet. Now listen to this. That's different. Did you notice that? 
This one doesn't make that sound. This one does. Do you think that's intentional? Do you think that the different colorways are a little bit different? Or is this one also supposed to make a sound? Hmm, what do you think? Are they supposed to be different? Because they're different colors? Or is that just like one of them's not working properly? I wonder. There's so many questions. There's so many things to discover with these. I'm really enjoying this. Okay, I have two more to open. I'm gonna do that really quickly. So I opened my last two. I'm gonna save the chameleon for very last and compare these two dogs. So I opened two colorways of dogs because this is a classic. This is the one I just opened and this is metallic. So I thought I would keep it. So now I have a metallic and a classic dog and I have a metallic and a classic cat. Cute. So those are my only doubles right now. Let's see how the classic one is. Hard to open, good to close. Opening is like really hard, but the closing is satisfying. Let's compare that to my metallic. Hard to open, not as satisfying to close. This one actually has a more satisfying close sound. It's worth it for the hard open so that I can do that satisfying close. Not bad, not bad, not great, but not bad. I'm surprised the tail doesn't move. I feel like the tail should twirl, you know? The ears come up and down, not a satisfying fidget for me. Cute, it's cute, because like dog's ears do that, but it's not like satisfying. The tongue, cute. I like that it makes the eyes roll. This is the curly chameleon. His tongue pops in and out, so it kind of like pulls out. I like how it feels. It kind of has like a little give to it. That's cute. I like it. The eyes, mm, not very satisfying to me. Uh, it's kind of actually like, kind of makes me feel ick. I don't like it. But the eyes move and they make a little sound. It kind of vibrates under your finger too. Same on this side. I don't like it, but you might. The tail is silicone and you can uncurl it and then it snaps back into place. Okay, let's see, the top clicks. Oh, see, I'm figuring it, this is my first time. I didn't like figure out how to play with them and then show you, I'm literally just figuring it out as I do it. So if you top the, if you click this, you see how the tongue pops out a little more. But I actually like pulling the tongue and snapping it back in. And I don't think it will break the toy to play with it like this, because this is satisfying in its own way. And then this is another, it's like a clicky. See how the tongue gets longer. Okay, okay, okay. So this one, silicone tail that snaps back, click, 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 pull and snap. And then the eyes, which I don't like, but some of you might. That was all of the Squirkies that I had bought. I actually really enjoyed that unboxing. I am now going to return these couple and I will look for the new ones like the Pop and Bop Butterfly and the Hedgehog and I will unbox those for you as well. If you want me to, let me know in the comments. But until then, I'll see you next video. Bye.